small bit of video in. Um, up that lane there, I went up this year, I've been up that this year, um, when I was doing, um, not Crook's Peak, but another walk I did, a spring walk. I went up there. Um, I can't remember where I was going now. It might have been the plantation. I'm not sure now. But that takes you to the big old hill farm at the top. Lovely building. Up through past the apple orchards. I'm always talking about this bit here. And I emerge from a field there which takes you along by the river axe to Bleeden. This is a junction point. Um, these apple trees here, aren't it? I've watched these apple trees since they were babies. There's a pheasant there. And I just zoom in before it goes. I've watched these plants. They have a male and a female pheasant. That's a good picture to take, isn't it, really? They'll probably fly off the moment they, they change. Not to worry, you can't do it all. I got a heron on uh, video, on the first video. Anyway, these, um, I've watched these as small apple saplings growing here. I've seen them being nurtured and cared for. And they're probably, the farmer's probably thinking, they've probably already flowered. Hoping that the lockdown will be finished so that he can sell his apples. But basically, apparently, um, people are buying cider and real elves privately. Apparently, since they can't keep up with the demand. So though the pubs are shut down, people are filling up their garages with it. Just a bit of information about our Somerset cider. Of course, a week ago, I went to Thatcher's and took some photographs when I was on the strawberry line. Anyway, folks, there's a few people out cycling. There's a few boy racers about, so you've got to be careful. That's why I didn't want to walk back this way. It's just as bad. It's probably worse on a bike, to be quite honest, in some ways. Um, but we're going, this is called Ship Late. Somebody come in behind me. This is called Ship Late. It's a little hamlet nestled in the Mendips. Lovely old barns. Lovely woods up there. I've been in those woods. I got lost in them once. I found my way out. So I came down here and got on this road. I have stopped at this gate a few times as well. And uh, in a minute, this road will go towards Loxton. You can, if you carry on following it, go to Compton Bishop, where St Andrew's Church is. But what I'm doing, I'm going to be turning off not far from here, going back, getting onto the levels, heading towards Rooks, Rooksbridge. Then I'll be going across more levels towards Wedmore. No, not Wedmore. Oh, I'm glad I stopped. There's a big lorry coming. Not Wedmore. Um, let me see. Might want to get around. Let me move my bike up here a minute. Not Wedmore. Um, Mark. I'll be going to Mark. And uh, it's a big glory. Oh, look at the size of that. So you never know what you're going to meet down a country lane, do you? Christ knows what that is. Massive, though. Anyway, now I'll be going towards Rooksbridge, cross the a very narrow single lane with huge ditches each side, which people have died in, by the way. And they've got their cars wedged and they can't open the doors and they've drowned in them. Maybe they were knocked unconscious first. Anyway, 
I'll be going to Mark, I'll be finding another little narrow track, heading for Birtle, um, I think it's Eddington, um, and then I want to find the Glastonbury Canal. It's an old railway line really. It's an old railway line. I'm hoping I can get that far and then the plan is to come back a different route not to come back this way. I'm going to come back um, near Limpsham and get onto the Route 33. After the Route 33, I'm going to get um, come past uphill, and that'll be the last big hill. And it'll be a big circular. But will I do it? I don't know. Over and out for a minute. I'm Got to get back on my bike. I've just let a huge lorry go by. I've just let a huge lorry go by, right? And there's cars coming all the time here. There's a big lorry going by, motorbikes. Um, they're all going up that way. And I'll just do a little bit of videoing down here while I can past this farmhouse. It's quite busy so I'm being very cautious actually. I go down a little bit of this and I'll be turning right down a little lane. Right, I'm going to turn off now actually. <laughs> 